Microphone check, microphone check. Adam is firing Flacco. Whoa, bold prediction, MJ. Sounds like hate. It's not hate. It's peace. It's peace. As words JBP, it's peace. Where do you come up with information like that, MJ? Now, this video I just seen on No Jumper was a first in No Jumper history for as long as I've been covering No Jumper, right? Now, a few months ago, I did my interview at No Jumper, which meant a lot to me. I've been covering this space for over five, six years. Not once has Adam ever put on his channel a video of someone else breaking down what happened on the platform. Never. Now, I'm talking about in all of the years. I'm talking about XXS, rest, RIP. I'm talking about way before the LRL dude, way before AD, way before all of this stuff. Nobody has ever done this. But today, seven hours ago, Adam22 puts this on the channel. As you can see, even the setup is different. This is a big, big look for the, sh for, uh, the stop, who is, we'll, we'll get to it, who is JBP's, one of JBP's biggest um, narrative pushers. So I think this was a chess move for Adam. To, this is what he did, right? He's going to bring this guy on, the stop. When he brings the stop on, the stop is going to basically remove the need for a Flacco. So when you have the stop and when you have Flacco, you, when you have the stop, you no longer need Flacco because this is what the stop does. This is him breaking down. Look it. You go, let's go through his videos, right? Sells with millions of people online really? with Shopify, social media, and oh marketplace integrations. Okay, boom. Okay, so let's go to his videos, right? All of his videos are breaking down JBP drama. And he does well. Shout out to him. 24K, 14K, 26K. He does very well. I'm sure he adds a lot of value. I think the guys even shouted him out. But anyways, 20,000 subs, kudos to him. You know, this is what he does. So it's very similar to Flacco, but he actually provides value to the content and doesn't just steal um, DJ Academics takes and regurgitate it. That's not him. So Adam22 gave him a big look for him to do that. I don't think y'all are getting it. This is huge for him to do. Like, what? Do y'all see that? He gave the dude a huge stop. Danny from the stop breaks down all the latest no jumper. He could have did that for Flacco. He could have put well, Flacco's breakdown of what goes on. Flacco does the same thing. But Adam was like, damn, this nigga's low-key beating me. I'm not going to lie. Flacco had a cold program going. He would... Be the one who starts the crap at No Jumper. Go home and talk about it before No Jumper even gets to react. Like the Brick Baby crash out. His reaction was done three, four minutes after. I know Adam was like, damn, this, I'm not having it. I'm not having Adam's business savvy. He don't care about, he's like, damn, this nigga's low key beating me. So he said, cool. How do I get away where Flacco doesn't have dibs on the content because he can go home less than 20 minutes away from um the apartment in the i mean i'm sorry then the studio that adam 22 has in the valley um according to multiple sources his residence isn't too far out so therefore he can go home and get that content now adam that doesn't benefit adam's business especially when the consensus of flaco is going down adam listen he kept quiet with all the stuff he dealt with it. he like damn whatever flaco do i'm gonna have to deal with it even with me I'm like, this weird ass nigga Adam ain't gonna hire me, but gonna keep doing. Nah, it's not that. It's like he 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 Flacco had a program that Adam couldn't figure out yet. So now that Adam's figured out his program, watch this nigga play chess. And the reason why is cause it's most solid people from this area. And then it's just real nigga shit, bro. Nigga not saying no shit that's that's should be foreign to anybody, bro. Just on some real nigga shit. If I'm over here and I'm dealing with niggas and this and that, if I'm in Florida, You're breaking up. Back and forth to, uh, to Reno and shit, bro. On the dead homies, I don't, you know, like down. If, if, if it becomes a narrative, well, shit. Right. So, right, so when I did drop it, I made sure, like, to tap in and say, yo. So, basically, what these clips are indicating is that people are tired of the nigga. Adam was, he was gassed. He was like, yeah, I got Flacco. Niggas fuck with him, even though he be disrespecting their whole culture. Nah, Adam, they woke up. But Adam not no goofy either. He ain't stupid. He's like, all right, they don't rock with Flacco. Okay, what's the next move? Boom, I'm going to bring this nigga in, Danny, from the stop. Why would he do that, MJ? Because we'll go to his platform right here, right? When we go to his platform, you see he's pretty good at what he does. And it's all JVP. He don't talk about nothing else but JVP. 
JBP, Mel, Mel Ford. He know everything about the fifth wall. He know about library, freeze. He knows about misogyny. He's hip. He's a JBP fan, right? Like all of us are. Now, Adam22 is going to steal him. Now, Danny from the stop is going to do nothing but no jumper content. Now, that waters down Poetic Flacco because Adam's giving him the juice already. This is posted, like, I don't think y'all, this is like Adam taking one of my videos and putting a little title thumbnail over and putting on, on the No Jumper page. This is Danny from the Stops video that No Jumper posted. Now, once have they ever posted someone's reactionary commentary on the platform? That's chess, 3D chess right there. That way, he has someone who has experience, as you can see here when he was dealing with JBP. He has someone who has experience. He, no longer do people go to Flacco because he's the inside man there and can provide an inside perspective. Now we can keep those numbers here in-house. Kudos to you. Kudos to you, Adam. This was brilliant. But most people won't pick up on it. But just notice this. When you see Flacco appearances going lower and lower, when you see his channel numbers going lower and lower, just pick up. Use this, right? His timing is, is, is the best timing. All, you know, just remember, the people you tear down, the people that, you're, that you disrespect on your way up are the same ones that you might have to be face-to-face -face with on your way down. So, you know, just always be humble, you feel me? Allah is the most powerful. He can change anything in a day. He can have you sleeping in your car making videos for six people. And then the next day, you have close to 20,000 subs with almost 10 million views and sat down with Adam22 and uh, interviewed radio legend bootleg kev and you know uh have one of the biggest hip-hop platforms in your home state it's the power of a law man but yeah shout out adam finally i'm like when is he gonna get rid of dude he figured it out he got danny from the stop boom we don't no longer hit we no longer need to hear flanco's inside perspectives got that situated now on top of that how do I do it in a way where I'm nice and people don't be like, wow, well, you fired me in the Lush situation, ADT. Now he just ushered him out. I like it. I picked up on it. I'm taking notes. Don't tr trust me. I'm taking notes right now. I'm going to write it down. I like that, big bro. Ah, boom. We don't no longer hit. We no longer need to hear Flanco's inside perspectives. Got that situated. Now, on top of that. How do I do it in a way where I'm nice and people don't be like, wow, you fired me in the Lush situation, ADT. Now he just ushered him out. I like it. I picked up on it. I'm taking notes. Don't trust, trust me. I'm taking notes right now. I'm going to write it down. I like that, big bro.